Hello everyone, how are you all doing? In this video, we are going to talk about the Mac OS 15 Beta 1. It is finally here with a lot of cool and fun features and new changes. But guess what? Why it is boring? Because all those new features and changes, here is a spoiler, are not here yet. These features, these really cool features. Now that I'm done with spoiling your mood, let's dive right into today's video. My name is Jay. This is Tech Hive. Make sure to hit that subscribe button if you're new here and talk about the all new wallpapers and new. things on the mac os 15 macintosh wallpapers are gotta be my favorite add-on on the beta one i don't see any exciting things on this beta except these wallpapers they are just so flipping good i just can't get enough with it these macintosh wallpapers come in so much more variety in so many colors and the animation of these wallpapers look really really sick it comes in yellow it comes in green it comes in red and on the screen you can see this is dark yellow and then this is your brown and there are more shades like uh, there is another shade of red let me show you guys here here is red then you can just tweak in and add in a purple color also which looks really really dope and then among these colors we also have some dark shades like dark gray and blue blue also looks really really cool i'm just saying that these are one of the best wallpapers we have got on mac for a really long time the gray also looks so flipping cool I am telling you guys, this is the best wallpapers add-on that we have got on Mac since a really long time. Now, there is a macOS Sequoia wallpaper as well that we saw on the keynote. This also looks pretty cool, but uh, I am just a big fan of Macintosh wallpapers. Except for this, there is not a lot of things that are new here. The battery section has been moved up and my battery health is 90% right now. I have been using it for the past couple of hours and the battery life has been pretty weirdly good. And at the same time, uh, the bugs have been pretty disturbing for me. I haven't yet received any codec update for Final Cut Pro. So Final Cut Pro is a hassle to use right now. I just can't export my file and it is really really bad if you use final cut pro a lot i should definitely say this that just stay away from this beta you should stay away in general but just don't install it right now because final cut pro is just not working properly other than that battery life is something that i have to test more and talk about in my follow-up video later this week so make sure to subscribe and turn on notification for that video but uh, yeah, Mac OS 15 beta 1 is pretty boring. I really wanted to use that iPhone mirroring feature. That was actually one of the biggest reasons that I updated to this firmware. But unfortunately, we are not getting it anytime soon. Just the same thing that we had the last year. Some features will be coming later this fall. That means when it will be released for public, it will be ready for the time being. We have to just use these betas. So expect expect the iPhone mirroring feature to come out in about two to three months around the time of September when new iPhones will be coming out. Well, that's pretty much it for today's quick little episode. I'm not the best person to make Mac OS videos, but I just thought that I installed this version so I should share it with you guys. I just can't get enough with these wallpapers. This is just one of the favorite things that I have got in a long time on my mac let me know down in comments below what all things i can improve about my mac videos because i really want to make mac videos but i really don't know how to properly make it and what all things i should show because i can't really seem to find anything new in this firmware right now comment down below what all new things did you discovered on this beta i will catch you guys in the very next episode peace out and have a great day everyone